Fortnite. Okay, who likes Fortnite? We like Fortnite. Oh, this game be fun? Question mark. Yeah, no, it's questionable. It it can be fun. It it's fun. Not to me, to other people. I don't mind the game. The game's okay. I've played it before. I played it till season six, probably. Uh, and that wasn't even, like, religiously like some people. I played it on and off, and then I stopped playing it. But the game is long-lasting. I even came back to it for a while, but I didn't stick around. It's good. I I'll explain. I just checked as well, and they're on season 16, my god. Uh, but no, Fortnite good, yeah. It's a free game, first start, that makes it ultimately like 10 times better. And it's the only reason why I think it gets away with what it does with the Battle Pass stuff. Also, it allows people to actually get the stuff on the Battle Pass without having to pay for it all, like Call of Duty. <laughs> and also, it gives, it the, gives people the ability to... Uh, get good stuff throughout the battle pass not all the good stuff at the end though the better stuff is at the end <coughs> like call of duty <laughs> so to put precisely it's a good game i hate to say it. it's a good game it's lasted a long time it's been around for a while and it's kept good it dropped a little 2019 but it bounced back, it was only for a period of time when other games and other things were taking place that it dropped and it has had its first share of drama. But it's survived. It has not only survived, but it's thrived. It doesn't my cup of tea per se because A, I find the game to be very sweaty at times and I will admit I'm not great at the game. I play it mainly because fun. Like I said, fun question mark, because it can be fun, though it can only be fun for so many times before the same thing gets repetitive. Now, what I think sets it apart from other games and what keeps it intriguing, what keeps it grasping, what keeps everybody there, is the fact that A, the map doesn't feel empty, B, it gets updated constantly. And new stuff is added, new things that are entertaining, new mods. It's not like Call of Duty or any other Battle Royale games that were well, Battle Royales, basically, that come out. It is entertaining to the max because new updates, new mods, it wants your money, but it isn't bloody grasping for it. That's why it takes its time with the battle passes and other things. And it knows what makes money work what makes it worthwhile to get your money. Also doesn't really add things that are game breaking, uh unlike certain games. <laughs> but it's a good game. And again, it doesn't make most Epic Games doesn't make most of their money from this game. They make most of their money from other things that they make. And then we have basically what the entire theme is, which is basically just price, uh, they do price loss leaders, which basically is just them giving it for free and then relying on people buying stuff from the store, the, uh, the uh, Fortnite store, and they make money off that though. They don't really need to as, again, price loss leader means that they can also uh, show people that their engines basically are... Uh, something that people should invest into and that their company makes good games make a game that's good for free then people will spend money on the game and on other products that the company owns loss leader uh, and they can afford to make a loss on anything anyway and epic games has again gone through controversies but it's never really hurt them because they make so much goddamn money i think one of the things why fortnite gets mean done is its player base it's 12 year olds 14 year olds and even younger who get memed on a lot and also streamers who get memed on a lot for try hiding against a bunch of 12 year olds also a bunch of all the um <laughs> memes that came out about people um kids taking the parents uh credit cards and buying fortnite skins and all that and the whole fortnite skin memes but yeah no it's to me it's an okay game. It's something you can sit down. The game's always been up to, updated. It's always new stuff. It's something you can sit down, play, watch, have fun for, for me, an hour, two hour. For other people, 
hours on end. I can max out maybe two hours and I might just die of, uh, of exhaustion from looking at a game that is so goddamn bright and colourful uh, that even an epileptic would struggle to play. But no, the game's okay. Like I said, okay, question mark. It is good, question mark. It is something that you can sit down, you can play. It'll pass the time. But for somebody who just casually plays like me, I am a filthy casual for Fortnite. I do not play it professionally. I do not play it religiously. I have a, I have a life. Uh, <laughs> it may not seem that way, but I have a life. Um, so I play it casually. I am not somebody who tryhards it. By the way, that wasn't a dig at everybody who plays Fortnite. You probably do have a life. I'm not going to lie. It's... Also because you're probably young anyway if you play Fortnite. And if you're not, then I have no reason to criticise you. But the majority of people who play Fortnite are probably young. But, yeah, the game's okay. It's fun. But it can be a bit overbearing at times. So anyway, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Comment if you agree or disagree with what I said. Subscribe, I guess. You can do if you want. No, actually not. You will subscribe. Do it. I demand. I demand the subscriptions. Uh, no, uh, but yeah, a uh, video coming out soon about Spain, probably. And then the one after that will be about Call of Duty, maybe. Depends how I feel. I might do some other videos in between. Depends what I think up. Well, I'm in my crackpot state while some led down. This will be the second video of today. Then again, I'm off tomorrow as well, so I can do um, a bigger video. I can do more videos when I'm off. I've got two weeks off, so I can do more videos if I'm not out and busy. But yeah, hope you enjoyed. Like I said, do all the things I've said before, and bye.